every day zombies come back. <sighs> Hello? It's Casey. If you're there, please And answer. this is the start of day eight. I've got a situation. Please. I can hear you. What is it? Yeah, I, I got spooked the other day. The crash rattled me. I'm sorry. It's just... I don't know who to trust. There's not many decent options out there, but... I'm getting desperate, so, um, I... I need to take a chance. Uh, on you. W what do you think? Can, uh... Can you help me out? Please? You've got my attention. I've been hearing things from the tower radio chatter. They found something, and I need it. Bad. Problem is, I have no way to get my hands on it without help. W without you. Now, I'm willing to give up what I know about the reserve. In exchange. Does that sound fair? You don't have to lay it on so thick, Casey. Tell me what you need, then I'll tell you if I'm willing to help. A pump flow regulator. A tower patrol founded by Memorial Lane in the Garden District. Uh, it's just another useless piece of junk to them. The problem is there's a potential showdown brewing over there between the patrol and a reclaimed camp. It could get bloody. Quickly. What else? I'd like to be fully informed before putting my ass on the line. Fair enough. What do you want to know? Showdown. Let's learn about the showdown first. Why are they fighting? Uh, you know, resources, territory, two opposed ways of thinking, butting heads. I mean, from everything I've been hearing on the radio the last couple of months, bad blood just keeps getting worse. Look, I'm staying out of it, but I, I can feed you more details if you want. Let's see about their belief system. How do they operate? What do they believe in? The tower is disciplined and committed to community. Everyone has to contribute to the cause. They must be doing something right. I've heard they have close to a thousand people inside their walls. Tower folks are fiercely loyal to their way of life. Maybe even to a fault. A bunch of loose cannons in the reclaimed. It's hard to know what they're up to most of the time. The tactics are all about surprise and intimidation. Guerrilla warfare mentality. And they love creeping the tower people out. Weird rituals and stuff. They seem less interested in control and more into sending a message. Let's see, their leader. Who's running the show for each faction? Mama leads the tower. She founded the community. I don't know much else about her. She stays out of sight. Her right hand, her enforcer, is Georgia. She's out there on the front lines daily. And from what I hear, she's a hard ass. Not afraid to mix it up. Get her hands dirty, you know? The reclaimed rally around this guy named JB. And no clue what it stands for. He's always proselytizing over the airwaves. Uh, frequency 54, denouncing the tower, saying they're already dead. He <laughs> freaks me out a bit, but there's no denying he has charisma. What's your take on all this? If the fighting keeps up, this city's gonna explode into an all-out war. The tower maintains some sort of order, right? I mean, they, they offer some sort of semblance of safety, sure, but... They don't hesitate to toss people out if they question authority. Once the tower kicks your ass out, there's no return. It seems cruel, but... I don't know. Maybe that's the way it has to be. The reclaimed are... eccentric. Well, let's put it that way. But JB really knows how to motivate, uh, get, get people to buy into his vision. Maybe they're crazy, maybe they're onto something, I, I don't know, who knows. They are inspired, though. Always going on about the liberation to live, not just blindly following orders to barely survive. I mean, I, I don't know. Maybe they're both a bit fucked in the head. I've heard enough info on the conflict. Okay. Uh, sorry. I, I know I can ramble sometimes. Let's see what Memorial Lane says. What's the area like? The Garden District was one of the wealthiest areas of the city, so, you know, no surprise, it avoided most of the flood damage. The folks hit hardest by the flood picked it as a spot for a memorial to victims. And two weeks later, when the dead started walking, the whole city was a damn memorial. That's all he has to say about that? I'm ready to do this. 
The pump regulator is a piece of industrial equipment about the size of a coffee maker. Uh, pipes, switches, knobs, you'll know it when you see it. Now, the Tower Patrol has it at their camp, Red House on Memorial Lane. And remember, reclaimed are nearby, so you might get caught in the middle of a strap between them. Now, once you have it in hand, hustle back to the radio and contact me. Time is not on my side. If you pull this off, I'll spill everything I know about the reserve. You have my word. Get on the radio, Casey has requested he'll share info on the reserve if I can acquire some machinery for Memorial Lane. It's in a red house controlled by the tower. Travel to Memorial Lane, speak to the tower lieutenant. Find the, the pump regulator body. Find the regulator dial. Should go be a ninja? First, I want to see the lantern, because that's what I was waiting for. <clears throat> Can I go this way? Yay. Why is the door closed? Push. Let's see. This way, this way. I know Omri is dead, and I know that for the time being you've stepped into his shoes, whoever you are. I am not in the habit of trusting people these days. Trust gets you dead when it's given to the wrong person, and there is a lot of wrong out there. But I am willing to set prejudice aside for a few moments so we can have a little chat, see if we can work together. I'm assuming you scored a few useful things out of that last tower cache. Well, there's more where that came from. As long as nothing happens to me. Understood? Get yourself to the churchyard. I will unlock the gate so you can reach the area. Stay out in the open. If I am satisfied you are alone, you will see me. Interesting. Move through the cemetery to meet that person. <clears throat> is this a timed mission? You know, I don't know if anything in this game is timed. But let's do this one first. <clears throat> So every time I make a gun, I get bullets. Why is it jittery? Share it. Non standard issue. that but I think this bat is stronger it's level three the shiv <clears throat> going this way. That's not the right way. The right way is where the candle is. Let's play sneaking around. Be 
fun if you could jump in this game. And that dead body never leaves no matter what. It's kind of annoying. Hits of the baseball bat, it'll take to murderize those people. That's the point, it's dead. Hello there. Let's see, how do I get into the red house without causing suspicion? Anthony, but he be so dense. He should have known better. Let's talk to this guy first. You got nerve rolling in here uninvited. Searching for something or easy pal. Don't mean to intrude. We don't need strays poking around right now. We have enough problems to deal with. Maybe I'm the solution. You know what? Yeah, you might prove useful. My brother is in some deep shit. Pack of reclaimed scum snatched him. Anthony's a good kid. Bit dim, but he doesn't deserve whatever those freaks have in store. We can't get anywhere near where they're holed up. Light blue house across the way. They'll gut him immediately if they see us coming. But you? They don't know you. You'll be able to stroll right in. After that, whatever you need to do, that's your business. Personally, I'd put a few bullets through their skulls. Let the dirt reclaim them. How did he get caught? Like I said, he's stupid. Cocky too. Not a good combination. I keep telling him he needs to toe the line. Tower Brass doesn't appreciate recklessness. Maybe this whole situation will teach him a hard lesson. Sounds like I can be of service. Get to it then. Knowing how those savages operate, he might not have much time before they execute him. So head to the blue house. <coughs> okay, let's go to the blue house. I like what that there's a GPS. These are people who have chosen to be savages, not rational people. People who understand and appreciate what the power is accomplished. Let's get that back. Let's hope they give me what I want. <gasps> Glue! Definitely a box of rocks. Uh, let's see. There's the blue house. Now to sneak into the blue house. Yeah, it's broken. Ooh, need ninja powers. I'm thinking we blind. Now, now is not right the time out. to be selfish. 
Now is the time to commit to a community, to be part of something. Our vision for the future is rooted in hope. It ensures a future for humanity. Cast despair aside. There is no point in clinging to it. Do not commit to isolation. Dedicate yourself to a grander purpose. And you will not be alone. Trust in us to guide you. And we will put our trust in you. Within our walls, you will be safe. Within our walls, your needs will be met. Within our walls, life goes on. The tower will always stand. Mama. Who the hell are you? The negotiator? A big tough... Don't go down the stairs, you dumbass. You're just dead. Oh, I should use this. Heal my wound. Heal my arm. Now there's no more. Ooh, cereal. Is all this <gasps> a dolly? I like those dollies. Powder. Look at those books there. Oh shit, I forgot to stab them in the heads. Where'd you go? Phones. <sighs> Bullets for a gun I don't have. <clears throat> Those people sacrificing people, they don't need to be alive if they're crazy psychopaths like that. Give, or are they just decorations? 
<laughs> okay, I'll take the pillows. <clears throat> A gun that's not broken? bullets for this gun. Yep, it's always good to backtrack and find what you can. Oh, I can have 36 bullets now. Awesome. <clears throat> Where do those people go? Dirty bandages. Bandages are bandages, I guess. Nothing in there. A <laughs> Twinkie. Let's see. <coughs> Can't open that. What's another door I could open? Crazy person. What else can I get? How much space do I have? Wait, how does this have workable metal? I need adhesives. Ah, oh, shit, my bag is full. No! I guess I won't take those. Books. Because I need bindings and adhesive. Goodbye, broken revolver. <clears throat> Goodbye, gorgeous and luscious pillow. Keep the dead zombie company. Come here, giant book. Guess I don't need a blue elephant. Goodbye. But I like the little scrappy doll. Special from Nola Tourist Trap. <gasps> It'll give me gunpowder. Oh man. Let's see. I guess there won't be a war anymore. But where did those zombies go? Oh wait, did that person kill them? He went out through this door. Okay, now back to the red house. Run, 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 running, 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 run, run, run. There's no background music, really. I could have sworn I saw something move. Hi. I was skeptical, but you pulled it off. Hi, I'm back. Can I have what I want now? Assemble the pump regulator. Gain access to the red tower. Do you care if I go in there? Guess I'm their friends now. Oh, a little cross. It's a special item. Hi, peoples. It's in my backpack. Oh, 
I don't have much room left. I'm gonna put a cross in my house. <clears throat> Here you go, guys. What's going Have a on? Pillow. Just hanging out, looking for stuff. Didn't have to murder these people. There's a ton more people in this place. You've given me a second chance. Thank yes, you. I, I promise to make the most of it. You better make the most of it. No more being retarded, person. <clears throat> Hi. What is that? A photo? Gone and forgotten. I don't need that. Why does it have to be so dark in here? It's dark, but the days keep. <gasps> I'm running out of time, holy shit. Okay, where the flip is that? Can't open that, it's broken. A broken gun. Bullets. Candelabra that's broken. <coughs> the statue. It's the item I've been looking for. <laughs> I need bullets. Canned sardines. Looks delicious. Box of razors. this why can't I recognize that why can't I have any armor why don't they have the why are the top story windows barred off like that a tiny Bible this is his junk <coughs> I'll give up my pink pillow. <gasps> no pink pillow. I'll give up the frying pan. I'll take a little Bible. Wait, I could have climbed up here. Hi, I'm looking for stuff that's inside this house. Don't need razors. Where is that stuff at? Is that really the stuff I need? Hey, big brother. There's not much to say beyond I'm sorry, but I have to do this. I can't sleep. I can't eat. I'm a wreck. Jeff, I keep seeing that little girl's face. These visions of her turning. This whole mess is fucking with my head. What did the Martins do to deserve being exiled? It makes no sense. They are good people. Now, I know this might put you in a tough spot. Please forgive me, but I need to make things right. At least give them a slim chance to survive out there. I swiped some supplies from our camp, so you know who to blame. Don't want any other innocent people taking heat. I'm going out to find the Martins and deliver the stuff. Least I can do. I pray it'll help me get my head straight. If I'm not back before the bells, wish me luck. Your little bro, Anthony.
What was that? Just me, your friendly neighborhood kid saver. Assemble the pump regulator. Okay. Wait, where do I do that at? Do I do that in my house? Where's Casey? Ah, <clears throat> oh, shoot. These boxes are definitely... Adhesives, bindings, metal... I can't put that down. Glue... Choices, choices. I don't need a shoe if I'm getting glue. I don't need that if I'm. Oh, wait. That's my little Bible in my house. <clears throat> don't need a little radio if I have this box. Hello. Circle. Where's the stairs? No. Shoot. Good sir, can you direct me to the stairs? Who's sneaking around? I'm not sneaking around. I want to go over there. Fine, I'll climb down the banister. Oh! And I hurt my leg. I could have sworn I saw something move. Where's Casey? Maybe. Maybe. Heard something. What's up? More glue. I would like to take that, but no, I don't have any room. Is that <gasps> medicine? Sheet. What does Ashtray do? Just metal? Is that a, a bottle? Sell the cork. Cool thing. Flashlight. A kitchen knife. Well, this is a nice spot to hide, but scanning the area. Go home. The back the back is full. Great, there's a ton of zombies. Hi, zombies. Follow me. Hi, zombies. Okay, could you kill them for me? Yes, kill the zombies for me. Thank you. What about that one? This one. Okay. Thank you. <clears throat> no, my stamina is low. Bye, zombie. I'm running away from you. Oh, wait, that's my HP. Place. 
that was a very eventful trip, and I got a lot of loot. I am so pleased with myself. <coughs> Let's empty my backpack first. Statue to collection. Go over there, frying pan. I'm gonna stick you next to my other ones. Now I have three. Memorial Lane Angel Special. One of nine commemorative piece set. One of a kind and cannot be scrapped. Three. My collection is coming along nicely. <coughs> Wait, this is new. Where did this come from? Can you trust stew? Wait, why is there stew on my table? Some get baby stuff? That's They're pretty nice. Ah, the pink pillow was clean. Okay. Now let's talk to this guy. You there, Casey? Come in. Yeah, yeah, I I'm here. Wow, <laughs> you're back. Did you get it? Oh, you're wow. surprised? You didn't think I was gonna come through, did you? Well, guess what? I did. I didn't know. It's insane out there. All kinds of shit could have gone wrong. But hey, this is great. Finally, some progress. It's a relief. Okay, uh, let me find the manual for that thing, and we can get it calibrated. You're stalling, Casey. I want to hear what you got on the reserve. I'm not doing anything until you hold up your end. We clear? Yeah, yes. All clear. Okay, the reserve is real. But you already knew that, right? What you don't know is that I am in it. It's an old military bunker built in the 50s or 60s. Right after the flood, the National Guard used it as a staging area to distribute disaster relief supplies. But once the dead started walking and things really went to shit, I had no choice but to get inside and hunker down. I thought I was safe for a little while, but now I'm fucked. The flood water up top was too much for the reserve's pump system. It, it malfunctioned, and now the whole place is on lockdown. I'm stuck in the comm room. I'm running out of time. I need to get out of here. Soon. God, I can't wait to see the sky again. I've been working with someone named May. She claims to have a key to the reserve. You know anything about this? If your May is May Benoit, then yeah. Yeah, I've heard of her. Tower is always tossing her name around on the airwaves. They're really after her ass. Consider her a major threat. I don't know anything about a key to the reserve, though. I'll do some research. If I discover anything, I I'll let you know. You were the only one to make it inside? Well, no. There were others, but they didn't stay. Um, they had to leave. Well, that doesn't sound suspicious. If the bunker was safe, why did they leave? Like I said, they left. They had to take care of something, okay? Nothing else to say about it. Okay, I'm gonna see Rumors are all over the place. What exactly is inside the reserve? Most of the rumors are true. Food, meds, tons of it. I mean, the entire hall was meant to help tens of thousands of people in the area after the flood. And there's a bunch of guns, ammo, and gear for the troops that were meant to distribute it. All military grade, perfect condition. Problem is, I can't get to any of it. The whole bunker is locked down because of the floodwaters. What's the rush to get out of there? Starvation, for one. I might have a couple weeks left of scraps down here. But none of that is gonna matter if the floodwater sitting on top of this place breaks through. The comm room is filling up slowly right now, but it's only a matter of time before the ceiling collapses. Starvation, crushed, or drowned. Pick your poison, right? Drowning sounds like a nightmare. 
Yeah, well, well, with your help, I'm hoping to avoid all of it. Fuck, I'd rather take my chances on the surface with a hundred walkers coming at me. At least I'd have a fighting chance. Look, tourist, I'm not asking you to do this out of the kindness of your heart. I mean, there's clearly something in it for you, uh, uh, big time. If the pumps get repaired, not only will I get out, but the supply rooms will all open up. All those disaster relief supplies, untouched. Not to mention enough weaponry and gear to arm multiple platoons. All for you to do with as you please. And for me? A fresh start and some fresh fucking air. Hmm. Why me? Why should I trust you? Sounds far-fetched. <laughs> You haven't been up front with me so far. Why should I trust you? Because my life is in your hands. I can't get out of this hole without your help. And look, hey, I get it. I could totally be full of shit. But one thing I know, no one else can offer you what I can. Without me, the reserve is going to remain buried. Forever. If you want the reserve, you're going to have to work with me. It's a chance you have to take. I'm willing to take the risk. Oh, fantastic. You won't regret it. Well, it it's been a long night, but I'm too wired to sleep. I'm gonna turn this place upside down until I find the manual. Uh, you should get some rest, though. I'll contact you in the morning. Good night, tourist. The kindness of strangers task has been updated. <clears throat> Wait for Casey to reach out again. And now, it is time for bed. Let's fix my pillows really quick. Make them a little more cozy. <coughs> Get my dolly. There we go. There, my bed looks wonderful. Let's drink my juice to go to sleep.